So we're officially in Amsterdam. Mm -hmm. We survived Central Station, which is ridiculously busy. But actually, since everybody speaks English, it wasn't that bad. That's very true. Um, we arrived to our little flat. It was super cute, a lot bigger than Paris, which is definitely great. We went to the store, we bought some food, stuff there, some Dutch as well, so we didn't really know what the hell we were buying, kind of. Um, and now we're just taking a stroll through Vondel Park, which is really, really nice. It smells like poop every once in a while. It doesn't smell like... I think I smelled it back there. Um, but the air is very crisp. It smells really nice. You can smell the greenery. You can see all the foliage. Beautiful. Look at this. I feel like we would never see anything like this. At least in Miami. Definitely no dogs without leashes. I know. These dogs are so damn well trained. Yeah, the dogs here are so well trained. You leave them off the leash, they go run, and they come back to you. And they don't bother us, which is great. I can see like four white ones. Like They have like... I can see eight dogs total right now that are like all off leash. Look, they're all like... There's only one that's on the leash. And it's they're just living one. the life. In a well-behaved way. They can have a tree house. Badass, man. How awesome is that? Best part, that's completely unsafe. So it's funny because we were saying in Paris uh, we would hate to raise a family because, like, it's not stroller friendly. Like, you can't you got you can't go up and down the metro with the stroller and stuff like that. Here is the complete opposite. Here, I would love to raise a kid here because it's just so like they have like little parks everywhere for them. Yeah. is the oldest house in Amsterdam. And only women live here. So this is our little apartment in Amsterdam. There's a little table there, windows that you can like pop open, and that's the street. And this is the couch, a TV, a pair of jeans that we're trying, a mirror. This is the door to go outside the street. They even have a map of central Amsterdam. And we are somewhere like over here in this direction. So, so far we've been to Vondel Park. We've been to the Oudekerk and Beige enough. And then today we're doing a half day trip outside of Amsterdam. Um, and then we're gonna go to the red light district tonight, hopefully. But yeah, this is the door that goes outside. These are some hanging stuff. This is our room. We just woke up. And then this is a balcony. This is our closet. This is our balcony. And two little chairs. And this is our view outside. And this is our dryer rack. We're actually washing some clothes, so we're gonna put some use to that. 
and then this is another door, and this is the kitchen. And we're washing some clothes. This is the little fridge. And then this wraps around back this way. And I don't think I've shown you the bathroom. And then this is a bathroom. Very cute, very quaint. A lot bigger than our place in Paris. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. And when this wood is dry, it's uh, very uh, light, uh, water resistant. Uh, and that is the main reason why uh, people in Halle still wear these uh, wooden shoes until this day. Uh, we have machines here, and uh, with the machine I can do it in three minutes. Okay, enough talking. Would you like to see some... Uh, yes. yes! Okay! The wood is dry, half the weight and water resistant.
look like. We're parking it the wrong way. Yay. All right, let's see how we do. 